Extra federal unemployment benefits will stop for millions of Americans who lost their jobs during the pandemic. Today is the last day they would see the extra $600 a week added to their regular checks. But the need for help in the tri-state is still growing. In tonight's top story, Eyewitness News Mike Pickett is in Owensboro with more for us. The enhanced benefits, which was part of the CARES Act that was passed earlier this year, was designed to help people pay their bills during the pandemic. But as they officially expire, local groups say the requests for help haven't gone away. We're certainly seeing an increase for requests, especially where rent and utilities is concerned, and obviously food assistance. Richard Rent Morris of the St. Vincent de Paul Society in Owensboro says they're at 35 percent above capacity in number of people looking for help paying rent and other bills. He says the mood of their clients varies as the deadline approaches. Some of our local neighbors have been locked in this for three months, so they really are feeling the stress. But the House and Senate have not agreed on future unemployment payments. Republican lawmakers propose cutting enhanced payments from $600 to $200 a week, while Democrats want to keep it at current levels. Rem Morris says clients depend on those enhanced payments to keep their lights on. It's huge, uh, especially for our neighbors in need that are anywhere between that eight, nine, ten dollars an hour. You know that's huge to be able to pay your rent, uh, to keep the the lights on. Rent Morris also tells us their group got about $100,000 in grant money to help people pay their bills, but that money is almost running out. In Owensboro, my picket, Eyewitness News.